Hi guys! What's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel and for today's video is another tipid tips para sa mga kaibigan natin at mga uh, kaikilala natin dyan na mga nanonood. So hi guys! So for today's video is pag-uusapan natin ang Cebuana uh, Micro Savings Account na meron silang 24K card and uh, sobrang malaking tulong to not only for me but sa lahat ata so sobrang ganda ng mga benefits nila and for today's video is yun yung pag-uusapan natin kung paano nga ba mag-apply magpa-member yung mga benefits at ano yung pwede nating um gawin doon sa card natin at sa account natin para maka-earn tayo ng pera. So, first things first, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do subscribe and give this video a like para naman uh, bongga na yung ating mga uh, videos and vlogs. Ayun, so, yan. Pag-uusapan natin ngayon is ang uh, Cebuana Luwilier Micro Savings Account with their 24K Card. So, ayun. So, personally for me, sobrang gamit na gamit ko to kasi Cebuana Luwilier talaga ang ginagamit ko uh, when I pay bills. Uh, especially sa plan ko sa Globe. So, yung mama ko is, meron kaming mga plan dito sa bahay at mga bills at mga tuition fees sa binabayaran. So, maraming mga uh, ka-partner yung Cebuana Luwilier which for me is sobrang gamit na gamit ko yung card kasi hindi na ako pupunta sa kanilang personal stores para magbayad at magpadala ng pera. So, ayun. So, Ayan, so meron din akong copy dito para hindi, wala akong makalimutan sa mga videos ko kasi yung mga ibang videos ko, may mga nakalimutan ako. So for today's video is meron akong kodigo dito para wala talaga akong makalimutan. So, uh, ayan, so for today's video is pag-uusapan nga natin to. So, uh, micro savings account by Cebuana Luwilier aims to provide easier banking access to Filipinos. It is a regular savings account but doesn't require maintaining balance. So again, there is no uh, maintaining balance dito sa ating Cebuana Luwilier micro savings account. Account holders can deposit, withdraw, anywhere at their most convenient time with Cebuana Luwilier's network for more than 2,500 branches nationwide. As a micro savings account holder, you can also pay cashless using your card in any 350,000 Union Pay and Banknet because yung micro savings card yung 24k card nila is powered by Union Pay and Banknet so usually yun talaga yung mga partner ng mga banks natin uh, when it comes to uh, cards like um, credit cards debit cards so yun so Union Pay yung kanilang kapartner dito sa kanilang uh, 24k card and also, micro savings provides Filipinos with more convenient and affordable means to save their hard-earned money. Ayan. So, let's go first with how to open a micro savings account. Now, this um, application ng micro savings account dito sa Cebuana Nalulir cannot be done online. So, kailangan mo pumunta sa nearest Cebuana Nalulir branch. So, in any uh, Cebuana Nalulir branch, so dito sa amin, merong apat or lima. At ang uh, Cebuana Nalulir, you can go anywhere na branches na yun. Ayan. Okay. So, number one, na kailangan kailangan mong gawin is you should fill out the client customer information file. So, meron, uh, pupunta ka lang doon, sasabihin mo yung teller na you want to open the micro savings account. So, bibigyan ka nila ng form. Next is, kailangan mong mag-provide ng one government issued ID. So, birth certificate will also be applicable to minors or to minors only minors minors only so if you're 18 below pwede kang magdala ng iyong birth certificate student id is applicable only if student is currently enrolled so if you're enrolled um, if you're a college student high school elementary so ayun pwede mong i-present yung iyong id but if you are an adult a professional adult bring your government issued id so, meron silang list dito ng kanilang mga government IDs. So, ayan. So, you can also check out their um, website. At meron din naman doon sa labas ng M. Louis Lear, may nakalagay sila doon ng mga list ng government IDs. So, usually naman mga driver's license, postal, ayan. So, meron din dito, uh, pwede ka rin gumamit ng, uh, ang tawag natin dito, uh, police clearance and by clearance voter certification from Comelec so ayan pasok na pasok yun so after that one after mong mag fill out ng form at makapag present ng ID what you need to do is to have a minimum initial deposit which is hindi naman masakit doon sa bulsa natin because only 50 pesos lang po this is just to make a first transaction just an initial deposit so uh, 50 pesos yung minimum so usually naman kayang kaya naman natin yung 50 pesos so yun lang yung babayaran mo na initial deposit so hindi mo na kailangan magbayad ng uh, 100 or ganon. So, if 50 pesos ang yung laman ng wallet mo, pwede na naman. And if you want naman na maglagay agad na malaking deposit doon, is okay lang naman. So, uh, 50 pesos yung minimum na kanilang um, deposit. And later on, pag-uusapan din natin ang kanilang maximum, uh, maximum deposit or yung laman na pwede mong ilagay doon sa mismong account mo. 
Next is, meron din silang card fee. So, yung card fee, sadly, is merong bayad. So, 150 pesos po yung bayad, card fee, which is uh, for clients na uh, 24K card. So, uh, ngayon is 24K card na yung kanilang uh, sa micro savings this 2022. And, uh, if kung naabutan mo pa yon sa mga nagtatanong pala, if naabutan mo yung old card nila, which is hindi yung 24K card, pwede ka magpa-upgrade for only 75 pesos. So, pero kung bago pa, kan, uh, bago ka pa naman, so babayaran mo yung 150 pesos na card fee. So again, 50 pesos minimum uh, initial deposit and 150 pesos uh, isang card at yung form and then pwede ka nang mag-open ng iyong uh, micro-savings account sa Cebuana Lowellier. So now, let's go with... Uh, Na, na open na yon. So, after mo pala na mabigay yung lahat, uh, they will give you the information and the card as well. Yung mismong araw na yon is meron ka na agad card. Hindi ka na maghihintay ng ilang weeks kasi ibibigay agad nila sa yon. So, ilalagay nila sa system yung information mo and everything. Then, they will give you uh, hindi ko kasi, hindi kasi pwedeng mag-video doon sa loob ng koan ng si Buana kasi bawal daw sa kanila. So, i-explain ko na lang. After nun, isibibigay sa'yo yung card. At ikaw mismo, doon sa labas na kanilang window, is parang merong small na machine, doon mo ilalagay yung card mo. Ikaw talaga ang gagawa nun para uh, ma-make sure na if ever na magdi-deposit ka or mag-withdraw, is alam mo kung paano. So, ayan. Ipapasok mo lang yung card mo, then you will make a PIN. So, yung PIN mo is ikaw lang yung nakakaalam talaga. So, it's a five-digit PIN. So, yung PIN ko is same din sa PIN ng ibang bank para hindi ko talaga makalimutan. So, ikaw lang yung nakakaalam kung ano yung PIN mo. So, make sure na hindi mo ipagsasabay kasi very important yun. And, ayun. So, after mo malagay yung PIN, then they will actually try uh, if hayaan kanila na mag-click click so bibigyan ka lang lang ng information don't worry kasi talagang i-assist kanila from the beginning hanggang sa end ng iyong transaction so which is a good thing about si Bona Luwiler so kudos sa inyo dyan mga talaga si Bona Luwiler after nun is ayan pwede ka ng card so pwede mo nang gamitin yung card mo para mag-deposit so how to deposit so fill out the form indicating the money that you will deposit and give it to the branch personal so parang napapadala ka ng pera yung form so ayun so maglalagay ka lang doon tapos ilagay mo lang yung purpose of transaction uh, deposit to your um, account doon sa micro savings and then okay na insert your 24k card doon sa POS terminal POS pala yung tawag doon POS terminal, then get the completed deposit slip. So, bibigyan ka naman nila ng resibo, yung deposit slip mo, na pumasok na doon ang pera mo. After that one, ayun, successfully na yung iyong deposit. Now, ngayon, how to withdraw naman? So, uh, to fill out the, to withdraw, you need to fill out the form with the desired amount. Same dun sa deposit mo, same lang na form yung gagamitin mo. After that one, insert your 24K card doon sa POS, type your PIN, and uh, lagay mo lang doon kung receive money from the branch of personnel. So, ayan. So, kukunin mo na lang yung pera mo, and then they will give you a withdrawal slip and resibo na nakapag-withdraw ka nga ng pera mo. So, how to check your balance? So, dalawang option ang pag-check ng balance if ever na pumasok na yung padala at if ever na nakaltas na yung winidraw mo. So, the first one is you may visit our Cebuana Lowellier's 2,500 branches and use the POS terminal to check your balance. So, ayun, pwede kang pumunta doon sa physical store if andun ka na. And, uh, if ever naman na nasa bahay ka lang, huwag ka mag kasi my second option, which is you may log into your account on the Cebuana app and tap into micro savings. So, if ever na meron ka ng card, if you're a card holder or if you're a market uh, micro savings account holder ng Cebuana Luwilier, uh, mas maganda if after noon is mag-log in ka na sa app. So, sa application naman ng doon sa app is ililink mo lang naman. So, you just need to download the Cebuana app sa uh, Play Store at sa iOS. Then, you need to fill out and sign up. Ilalagay mo lang yung card mo doon. So, just follow the instructions. Ang sobrang dali lang siya. And then, lagay mo lang yung PIN mo yung pin na yung 5 digit pin na ikaw lang nakakaalam para i-confirm at i-verify na sa yung nga yung card na yon at sa micro savings account na yon. So after noon is ayan, so yun lang yung dalawang gagamitin mo. So ayan, so and also bala doon sa paano nga ba magbayad on the uh, doon sa mga stores for example for me sa Globe Plan ng ng mama ko. So doon is doon sa mala, sa options nila sa applications nila is i-click click mo lang yun doong uh, send money 
and then mal- mapupunta ka doon sa list ng kanilang mga partnered uh, stores, uh, companies, at even sa schools. Kasi may mga schools din na tumatanggap ng tuition fees, uh, bayad, mula doon sa Cebuana Louis Learn na app. Ang maganda dito is, if ever kasi na mayroon transaction doon, for example, for me, if ever na nagbabayad ako ng plan, globe plan, doon sa uh, physical store sa Cebuana Louis Learn, may 5 pesos na transaction. So, if gagamitin mo yung app and if you're using your micro savings account, cashless, wala kang babayaran na transaction fee. Sobrang, parang free, free na siya. Parang ganun. So, yun yung pinakamaganda doon. So, may mga list doon if you want to uh, pay your uh, PLDT or your Globe by the tuition and doon lahat ng mga partner na mga uh, kapartner ng Cebuana Luwilier. And also, um, pwede ka ding mag-send ng money from your micro savings account to your um, banks and vice versa from bank and also to your micro savings account and also at the same time pwede kang mag withdraw gamit yung card mo sa kahit na anong ATM branch may fee nga lang sa banking fees for para sa transaction but aside from that sobrang convenient kasi pwede ka nang mag withdraw hindi lang doon sa Cebuana Luwi Learn stores but pwede ka ding mag withdraw in any ATM machine dito sa Pilipinas and ayan so let's go ahead with the uh, product details so since na micro savings nga ang Cebuana Luwilier, pwede kang mag-earn ng interest doon sa mga dineposit mo. So, yung minimum balance to earn interest is only 500 pesos. Pag meron kang 500 pesos na nakalagay doon sa iyong card or sa iyong account, and one year, annually, makaka-earn ka ng 0.20%. Isa to sa pinakamalaki na uh, interest, uh, earning interest na nakita ko kasi other than other uh, banks na meron ako is 10% per annum lang. And then, pinakamababa ata ito na minimum uh, balance para maka-earn ng interest. So, if meron ka 500 pesos na dineposit mo lang, pinatulog mo lang ng one year doon sa account mo is mag-earn ka ng 20% uh, 0.20% o oh, di ba ng 500 pesos mo so there is no minimum maintaining balance and there's no dormancy period so hindi mag expire lifetime itong card mo so for 100 pesos meron ka ng lifetime micro savings account and then ayan so meron din silang deposit amount which is ang minimum nila ay 50 pesos at ang maximum naman na deposit amount dito sa card mo is 50,000 withdrawal amount is minimum of 100 pesos at yung maximum naman is 5,000 so, ang deposit fee, it's actually free. So, number of allowed withdrawals per day is that long basis. So, pwede kang makapag uh, withdraw ng 5,000 three times every day. So, withdrawal free is free so far. Yung withdrawal fee, hopefully, hindi mabago. Kasi ang nakalagay sa kanilang uh, website is free until further notice. So, sana walang babago, ba? So, new card fee. If ever na wala mo yung card mo, magbabayad ka lang ng 150 pesos. Ganoon lang siya ka-simple. And last but not the least, card upgrade para sa mga existing micro savings account holders is 75 pesos. Doon sa mga hindi pa naka, hindi pa naabutan yung micro savings na 24k card. So, that's it for this video. If meron kayong mga tanong, wag kayong mahiyang magtanong dun sa uh, comment section below. Just put your comments down below. Questions, suggestions, and also, if you like this video, like, subscribe, and share this video. And hopefully, uh, magbigay kayo ng mga ideas kung ano pa yung mga gustong videos na gawin ko because I am very happy to do that. And hopefully, nag informative tong video na to sa inyo, especially sa mga students, sa mga uh, gusto mag-open ng micro-savings account para sa future. So, that's it. Hope to see you soon in my next vlog. And, ayan, God bless, and see you.